Welcome back to Basement 1F, where even the dead don't get the day off. I'm your host, Mitch, and I'm joined by Miss Hangover of the Year, two years running, Scary Sally. There's not a bourbon I will not guzzle. Tonight, Terror City is crawling with more than just your garden variety creeps. It was the Undead Pride Day, where every creature, undead and dead alike, come out to party. Absolutely, Mitch. The streets were swarming with the undead who were less about resting in peace and more about partying in chaos. Skulls, guts, and gore galore. And let's kick things over to Shadow where she's out at the festivities. Thank you, Mitch and Sally. It has been an insane day of festivities. The party only really kicking off after the undead fight parade. Tons of zombies, ghouls, and the odd mummy have come out to let their undead fly fly. The parade floats were sweet. I've never been pelted with so much candy and ectoplasm before. I have, Mitch. Back to you and Sally in the studio. And let's talk about the last bloodbath float. Vampires tossing packets into the crowd like gruesome confetti. That's not just a spectacle. It's a statement. And speaking of, a human out ate all zombies at the annual braiding contest. Kathy, a seemingly sweet lady with a taste for brains, has set a new record by consuming 13 pounds, beating out the old record held by the zombified corpse of Chris Farley. Here's contest organizer Brandon Bubbleguts with his reaction. Kathy's performance was unprecedented, though it was really unsettling. And Kathy herself had this to say. I love the taste of brains. It's fun, and they're quite nutritious. With the living joining in, next year's contest could see even more fierce competition. Will more humans step up, or is it just still a crime? From all-you-can-eat brains to the bone-rattling beats of the undead band, Bobby and the Bone Biters. Our city was alive. Well, sort of. With festivities that celebrated our unique blend of the living and the undead. Dr. Terrormind, our despot ruler, gave a heartwarming speech reminding us all what makes Terror City special, our unity in diversity. Here in Terror City, we celebrate life, afterlife, and everything in between. Just make sure you hose this place down when you are done. The smell is astoundingly bad. The day wrapped with a sky lit by eerie green and ghostly blue fireworks. A rare sight for our usually dark loving city. And let's not forget about the food stalls. Blood popsicles and brain burgers, anyone? And don't forget, this party goes on till sunrise, because after that, the vampires start dying. Keep it locked on Basement 1F for all the nightmarish highlights. Remember, when the undead march, we bring the dark carnival right to your screen. See ya. Yeah, bitch.